It looks like we're in a fantasy blob land. A cross between marshmallows and mushrooms that sprung up everywhere. Just about to get hit by a pretty crazy snow squall. Absolutely do not want to be standing underneath that. I assume that's safe. How can you not be mesmerized by that? <laughs> wow. Winter in Japan is without doubt my favorite season. It's simply spectacular. But whilst it might look really snowy here at my winter base in central Nagano, the real action is taking place about two hours north of here. So that's where we're headed, to Japan's famed snow country. This is such a beautiful spot. Behind me is Asama Volcano, probably Honshu's most active and famous, but bitterly cold. My fingers are just literally about to fall off. I'm currently trying to intercept some snow devils. There are these little vortexes spinning up around here. I've made it to snow country. Nowhere else on earth does such a low-lying region with such a high population get dumped on by so much snow and with such regularity than right here. has to be the biggest snow pile I've ever seen. And it's taller than most of the buildings around here. Got a bit of a break in the weather now, so I'm gonna head up to my little guest house I've booked. It's a few kilometers up the road, get settled in up there, and then wait for the real meaty weather to kick in tomorrow coffee and weather models. I feel like I'm chasing a typhoon right now. It's a beautiful morning here. Uh, sun's kind of shining. There wasn't any snow overnight, but that is not gonna last too much longer. It's great to finally have a vehicle which is well suited for these harsh winter conditions. I've got myself an all wheel drive Toyota RAV4, but most importantly, it's equipped with a brand new set of Blizzak winter tires, which are absolutely essential for navigating these dangerous snowy roads. The snow's starting to come down now, so I better hit the road and head towards my destination where I'm gonna film this snowstorm. Turned into a train spotter because really good timing. This extremely cool train is coming through, blasting the snow out of the track, so I gotta run up here to get ahead of it and get a cool shot. I assume that's safe. Here she come. The real heavy stuff is moving over now. The result of this frigid Siberian air mass moving over the relatively warm sea of Japan, hitting the mountainous terrain of Honshu, and then absolutely unloading this massive amount of snow.
the amount of snow on some of these roofs is just tremendous. You absolutely do not want to be standing underneath that when it decides to slide off. During these big sea effect events, snow clearing is just a non-stop activity. This whole town is just buzzing with these massive machines, endlessly plowing, spraying, digging snow, just non-stop. Wow, these are some pretty gnarly driving conditions now. I not a huge fan of being on these kind of quiet provincial roads at night which is why I'm trying to get back to my hotel before it gets dark. Made it to my hotel so it's good to be here in one piece and I'm intrigued as to what the situation is going to be when I draw the curtains in the morning and look out the window. It's time to forget about the whole work aspect of this and just take in for a moment what an incredible sight all this snow is falling at night. It's just absolutely relentless. Just look at it, how can you not be hypnotized and mesmerized by that? Hey mate, I hope you're doing well. I am being a complete mad Englishman and trudging through these ridiculous drifts uh, in Niigata Prefecture. It is absolutely dumping it down. And I absolutely wish you were here as well. The snow has eased up this morning, but everywhere you look around here, it looks like we're in a fantasy blob land it, it's it's kind of hard to describe it it's like a cross between marshmallows and mushrooms have sprung up everywhere well everywhere i look people are clearing snow the hotel staff are very kindly helping me with my car uh, which obviously i wouldn't be able to get in without the use of a shovel snow isn't just snow i know that sounds really obvious but for people who aren't used to it it comes in many different forms shapes and sizes uh, yesterday it was the huge fat flake variety and right now I'm just kind of getting bombarded by little snow grains. Just about to get hit by a pretty crazy snow squall, it's just sweeping in. Here it comes, this is going to be pretty nuts. It's just turned into a complete wide out here, here we go. There's a really big snow clearing operation going on today. There's lots of people out on the streets scooping and they've got this very smart system where this big network of drains and they just scoop up the snow, dump it into the drains and off it goes down to the river. And sometimes amongst the hustle and bustle of town, you just find a place of complete tranquility. Great to be back exploring snow country again for the first time in about three years and if you've made it this far in the video i just want to say a huge thanks your support does mean a lot if you're not yet subscribed please go ahead and hit the button below and it's shaping up to be a pretty cold and snowy winter in japan 
So I'm definitely going to be back here again and I'm really looking forward to bringing you guys along and sharing the adventure with you.